Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back once again, bringing you another tutorial with another video on the channel. And today I'm going to show you how to do a hard reset or factory reset on your Xiaomi Mi Box second generation. Sometimes you have a lot of apps installed and it's freezing up, right? That can happen. Or maybe you sold your Mi Box and want to wipe everything, remove your accounts and settings. I'm going to show you how to do a hard reset on your Mi Box. First, what you're going to do here is go into settings, okay? Settings, select that option and press enter here. In settings, guys, you're going to scroll down here until you get to system. In system, you're going to select the bot option. Alright everyone, here you'll find the reset option, okay? You're going to press OK on your remote, alright? On the reset option, and just remember, this will erase all your data, okay? It will remove all the accounts that are linked to your Mi Box. That's why it's important for you to have your Google account password handy, in case you want to add your account again later. Resetting is good because it makes your TV box faster, right? And it also removes the apps you no longer want to use. I'm going to click here on the reset option to restore it to the original settings. Here I can select erase everything, so you just click on that option. And that's it, it will start the process of restarting the TV box and erase all the data. So you can set up your TV box again from scratch, right? You'll enter your initial settings, just like it came from the factory, add your Google account and connect to your Wi-Fi, right? And you can also adjust other settings, like the remote control and so on. Let's wait a little longer to show that it has been reset here. The Google TV logo just appeared. Alright, folks, now it's on the setup screen, so just follow the instructions on the screen, enter your Google account, your Wi-Fi, and any other settings. So that's it folks, if you liked the video, if it worked for you, leave a like because it really helps the channel, and also leave a comment if you had any trouble doing this procedure. In the next video, I'll show you another way to do the reset, so it's important to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications. At the end screen, I'll leave two videos related to this topic. Click on one of them, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks, see you next time, I'm out.